In this video, I'm going to break a working ResSim model to um, help you understand a little bit about the error messages. And so when you get these error messages, then you'll know how to go through and debug them. So right now I have a working model. So we'll go ahead and run this and we can see it runs to 100% and uh, we do get results. So the model is, is working fine, but I'm going to go in and I'm going to break it um, using one of the uh, common errors that uh, you can get in ResSim. And it, it's easy to forget sometimes to put in what's called lookback data. Now, the uh, alternative uh, that we're using is this spec test. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my lookback tab. And you can see I have a lookback elevation for my reservoir and a lookback release. But I'm going to get rid of the lookback release. And I'm going to save it. And now what I'm going to do is try to rerun it. And you can see now I get an error message. Unfortunately, though, the error message doesn't say you're missing uh, lookback data. It just says that you have an invalid flow calculation. Flow is, I guess, that that's negative infinity or something. Um, so I don't know that this really leads you to uh, directly to the error message. But when you see this, um, and also if you don't get past 25%, normally it means that there's something that's wrong in the setup. And so this is just one of the errors that you can run into, but it's a very common one. So I wanted to uh, just take a look at that and say, if you get this, one of the first things to do is just go look at the, the look back to make sure that you've populated all of those values. Um, I'll be making some more videos where we take a working model and break it and then take a look at the, the error messages. Uh, so if you want to see when those come out, uh, feel free to subscribe to the channel and, and thanks for watching this video.